Good afternoon from sunny Queensland. This is Matty and I'm Alex Zar from Saffron Company. We're just going to explain to you what our saffron honey is all about, how it's made and what it's used for. As some of you might know, Matty has an engineering degree in food sciences as well as he studied medicine as well as being a health advisor. And as for me, I have been a chef for many years and now a saffron merchant. So saffron honey was something that was going to become sooner or later. But now it's here, it's been here for almost two years and it's one of the most popular products on our website. But a lot of people do ask, what is it for? How do I use it and how do I keep it? So I'm just gonna ask Matty to give us explanation on what is saffron honey basically. I have a really extreme passion about our saffron honey. Uh, it's one of our very, very first creation. So um, we initially, we initially uh, make saffron honey to become as a functional honey. And uh, by definition, um, if, you wanna, if you wanna analyze the usage of the honey, Alex, usage of the honey bags to many, many years ago before human third brain, which is a creative brain, uh, being developed. Nearly 100,000 years ago. Yeah, some scientists even believe that uh, discovering the honey was the main cause of development of the last stage of our brain. Yeah, the creative brain. The creative brain, which is the biggest part of our brain as a human brain. So honey is, uh, I mean, uh, my, I have to correct myself, the raw honey which never been heated, never been pasteurized as a natural source of the honey is the superfood which carries many, many great things like the minerals, uh, plant-based hormones, some amino acids, some AD vitamins. Plus, in fact. Yeah, AD plus uh, bio, bio elements, yeah. So what we do with our honey is, in our company, we initially employing honey as a natural preservative, natural additive, as, as opposed to, to sugar. So, natural sweetener? Yeah, natural sweetener. So we don't use any sugar to um, protect our products. We are a sugar-free company. Absolutely. Sugar-free, in fact, sugar-free, color-free, additives-free, preservatives-free. So we use and we employ honey to cover all the aspects and uh, since honey is a superfood itself, so not only uh, protect the elements that we add into it, in this case saffron, but also enhances the um, value of the food. And saffron is a superfood by itself. Absolutely, yeah. So combining two superfoods and using the honey nature to protecting the saffron against oxidation, and also it, it make it very delicious, so it make it accessible for many, many people to take, I think that's a very smart way of bringing saffron to people's table. So a couple of years ago, um, when we started selling our saffron in Noosa Farmers Market in Sunshine Coast, Queensland, uh, we wanted to see what people's reaction is to saffron. But a lot of people were like, you know, I don't know much about saffron. How do I use it? What is it good for? Yeah. You know, what does it taste like? What does it smell like? Well, that's why saffron honey was born because we wanted them to not only experience the taste and the color and aroma of the saffron, but we also wanted to preserve the goodness of saffron. Absolutely. And that's where honey comes in, yeah. because honey is used as the pres preservative, especially raw honey, which hasn't been heated. There is no chemicals, there's no additives, there's no color. It's basically from the hive to the bottle. So that's what saffron honey is. Sure. So I guess the next question that we would like to answer that people keep asking us is uh, how is saffron honey made? So tell us, Matthew. Sure. Well, in order to infuse anything, Alex, into the honey, since honey is such a dense food, either you have to heat it up to, through the heating process. Which, which become, we don't want to do that. It became a little bit liquefied and uh, add whatever you wanted into it or do the cold infusion. So obviously with our policy, we are against um, um, heating. Uh, heating and treating and pasteurizing and all those things and we keep everything in the closest to, to nature. What, na what nature intended. Yeah. So with us is the cold process, which is within a four to six weeks, depends on the season. Every day we mix our saffron with the honey uh, as a cold process. So our honey never get heated, our saffron never get heated, and the, the, the methodology that we have is unique to us. But uh, just for you guys to know, it's a cold process, 
never been heated, never been pasteurized. Yeah. So the next question, Matty, is um, how do I use saffron honey? Beautiful, beautiful question. That's a delicious question, actually. Yeah. Maybe I should ask, answer that question <laughs> because I'm a big fan of saffron honey on good, high quality sourdough. A little bit of uh, feta cheese just uh, on top of the bread. A little for Persian tea. Uh, and then saffron drizzled on top of that, saffron honey drizzled on top of that. And this is my breakfast with a beautiful quality Persian tea. But sure. how else can we use saffron? We suggest uh, having saffron honey for almost everyone around the house. However, there is some concern. And this is just a concern. Um, if you have a children um, younger than younger than five years old, okay. or if you have a pregnant lady in the in the third uh, trimester of the pregnancy, we suggested to completely take it easy with the composition of the uh, saffron and the, and the honey. honey. Yeah. Um, um, not because it's dangerous for them, but because we don't want to take the risk. That's that's all. It's not dangerous if just, you know, they have access to it as a random, uh, I don't know. And that's in terms of allergies? And yeah, stuff? just because of the allergy. Not, not, it has no any other reason, actually. Okay. Yeah, has no any other reason, yeah. So but the rest of else? the family, yeah. most welcome to have it by any means. How else reason. can they use the saffron honey? Well, uh, you guys can comfortably um, have the saffron honey in your tea, in your coffee. Uh, as a natural sweetener, add lots of yummy flavor to your drinking tea or coffee, add it to the just water salad. drink it, salad dressing, mix it with your olive oil, a little bit of the vinegar, salad dressing. What about um, in saute dishes? You, you can cook it, as, you can even use it as a saute, yeah, it's extremely versatile. But the, the initial idea of using the saffron and honey together is to get the um, raw experience from the goodness. So I wouldn't suggest it to heat it up too much. Okay. I would suggest it kind of, you know... What if they add it at the end of the cooking process? Brilliant idea. Yeah. Add, it, add it by the end of the cooking process. Brilliant idea. Yeah. Um, spicy chicken wings. Um, yum, 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 yum. Uh, what else? Uh, well, I personally... Drizzling I personally, on, yeah, drizzling and, and anything. Yeah. Drizzling on veggies that are coming out of Ooh, the yum. oven. Yeah, yeah. If you want a little bit of sweet yeah. or sour sweet. An and aroma and the beautiful color. Yeah. 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 And other things, Alex, I want to make is um, our saffron honey is extremely rich so in terms of the saffron we add a top-notch high quality saffron into our honey and guys I want you to know that we are the only company in the world that practically doesn't sacrifice the quality so whatever we made we always consider the top-notch quality in it yeah yeah we have seen some uh, companies, I don't want to name here, but we have seen a few companies that try to make saffron honey uh, by actually, you know, dropping a few threads of saffron into honey, and that's not the way it's done. Uh, if you're after the real taste of raw honey and beautiful Persian saffron, uh, we would encourage you to shop online and give it a go. Here is a little uh, discount code for you. By the way, all of our products come with a 30 days money back guarantee. That's how confident we are that you're going to love it. And if you have any questions regarding these products or any health related questions, please do send it to Matty. Absolutely. If she has the answers, then we will reply back to you straight away. If not, we will research and find the right answer for Absolutely. you. Or, or if it's asked commonly uh, through many viewers, then we will actually make a video for it. Uh, Alex, before we finish, um, I would like to add something. Well, um, in, in our business, we do everything as a fresh from scratch in a weekly basis. So whatever product you purchase from us is been made by ourselves or is been made by the other people that we trusted. So we work with them very closely. And we don't have a big warehouse. We don't have, I don't know, the production line. Whatever we do, we do by hand and we do by love. Small quantities. Yeah. And we love, we love to see you healthy and happy. And thank you very much for watching us. Cheers.